happening folks, quick update on uh, the MX-5 we were talking about in the previous video that the rear axes were getting replaced on they are an absolute mess um, we decided we were cutting off all the rotten sections which we would do we got from one side of the arch near to the sill and Jesus Christ it's an absolute disgrace somebody has actually cut out the metal as if they were going to weld it and then pieced it in with a big sheet of fiberglass so when I started cutting it out I was like what the hell is this so I pulled it off and it just came off in one big chunk I'll just show you just now that's the fiberglass here aye that's, that's it there it's just like sheeting aye it's that matte sheet mat, see the matte dressing they've used look at that it's lightweight bro I don't know why I used to use it as a drift machine but uh, I think it'll take, they're taking the piss there, ain't they? As you can see, we've cut off all the rotten part from that side, which is there. But the inner, the inner wing's a bit, a bit nasty as well. We've cut some of that out. I think we're going to have to speak to the customer and see where he wants to go with that. But this was the bit here. They've actually cut along that section there and pieced the whole bit here with fiberglass so as soon as I touched it it fell off like that literally pulled off and there I've had to cut that bit of metal there was only about a decent metal that was there but as you can see here somebody's bodged that up as well you can see some of the fiber, fiberglass strands here so I need to speak to the customer because obviously when we priced this up we had no idea that the inner wing was going to fall apart so but We've got that, and God knows what the other side's going to show us. Because I think they've done the same, I have Craig, they've done the same on this side as well, look. Aye, look, there. Yeah. There's the line where the actual fiberglass is broken. And it goes all the way across there and down. Yeah, you could give it a wee wallop with that, just to see. Aye, there we go. Look at that. Ah, there we go. Now I'll up your lap now in a one big sheet. Jesus Christ. Like, like, you see the fiberglass strands there? It's nasty. It's held on. Nice. <laughs> well, there we go. One big strip, look. Like. <laughs> hey, you see there? That's the actual strands there. Slam. Ah, there's my wings. Oh, that's, that's, a sleeve. that's a sleeve. Holy shit! That. Oh! Is that even get metal matting in it? Look. <laughs> and you wonder why I said the shape. Yeah, fucking back end just falls apart on them, don't it? Look. Do it right there. Oh. That's a wee bit stuff there. Wow. That's about it. <laughs> that so as you can see we've got a workout for us on this jobby um, We ain't Craigie boy Are they still bees? <laughs> She's dead A fair thing I. Do you want like a coilovers? Funny thing is the guy's got a set of coilovers on it are over a thousand pound They still are Pretty brand new, they're like brand new They're brand new They're brand new They're brand new, they're brand new. They're brand new. They're brand new. You seem to put them on it, but... Yeah, but they only stud the thing on the car. Same with his wheels. His wheels are an absolute fox in his wheel, ain't they? Ain't they style, not too sure. Got all day. Well, we'll get more footage of some of this rusty beast 
and we'll get back to you and what we can do. We'll speak to the customer, see how far he wants to go with this car because as far as we're concerned, that's ready for the scrap heap. Uh, we've got the parts there to weld it, but to put the outer skin on, I just don't know how far he's going to want to go with the inner skin. So we have a special car in the garage. Uh, it was one we done now on two years ago. It's a BMW M3, uh, the owner's Zach. We completely stripped, rebuilt the whole car, painted inside the door checks, inside the boot. He spent an absolute fortune on it. He spent a fortune on it when he was in getting the paintwork done, and then he went absolutely tonto after that. Um, put Wildwood brakes. Hey, sorry, AP racing brakes all round, discs, front and back. Carol race seats, everything he's put. I couldn't even fathom or imagine how much he's been on it, but it's been a lot. He's back with us now because he's doing a couple of wee bits. We scrape on the door and he's done a couple of bits and bobs. But I mean, it used to look like this. This is where it's looking like now. Nearly two years ago we done this and his wings had quite a lot of work done to them uh, with a lead filled them still looking absolutely stunning. It's the interior. A little thousand pound shifter. I don't know, it was about a thousand pounds for that gear shifter. I do believe he's still got full carbon uh, fibre door cards to go on it. He's still got a cage, roll cage. And that is a, I can't remember what the name of that bloody bootleg is, but that's a genuine one. C CSL or something, yes, CLS. something CLS or something. Um, bought it straight from BMW. I mean, the guy did not scrimp or scrape on any part of this car. Let's get the carbon. I don't know if you can see from here, but some carbon fiber rear diffuser. Genuine carbon fiber as well, not fake. We're going to do the work that we need to do on it. We need to paint the two doors, paint the mouldings, and small bit inside the check is chipped. So get get those done. Give the car a full machine polish again and a wax, and get it outside. Take it for a drive. Let you see what it's like. I'm pretty sure he's done a ARP ACL on road. Well, I mean, I feel bottom men's been done, ACL, big end shells, and corn rod bolts and stuff like that. So he's yeah, something that depends as well, we don't depend on. I think he was talking about the cams. No, I don't know, yeah, but I know he's got something in the head. See, to be fair, the, the list is long with this one. I, I couldn't even tell you. I'm only going off the top of my head on it, but it's had a fair, fair amount done to it. Um, I know that when he brought it in, he just done decat. Aye, decat, aye, we have milk tick exhaust. Aye, it's heh heh. No, it's not. Um, but he's aye, he's spent an absolute fortune, so we'll get a look at it. Aye, proper look at it once we've done all the work to it. 